Now that you know what a complex number is, which is the number of the form a plus bi, where a and b are both real numbers, we'll be looking next at operations with complex numbers. And the example we're going to consider together here is the subtraction of two complex numbers. So the first one we have is negative 3 plus 12i. And just to point out that the negative 3 would correspond to a and 12 to b. And we're going to subtract from that the complex number, the square root of 5, which would be our a value, plus i times the square root of 7, where the square root of 7 would be our b value. So I think you'll agree that what we need to do is to rewrite the first number, negative 3 plus 12i. And we'll distribute the negative sign through the parentheses of the second complex number. So we'll then have minus the square root of 5, minus i times the square root of 7. Now what we would like to do next would be to combine together the terms that are real numbers, which would be the negative 3 and minus the square root of 5. And since that can't be simplified any further, what we would do then is simply write minus 3 minus the square root of 5 inside parentheses to represent the real portion of our answer. And then for the imaginary terms, which would be 12i and then minus i times the square root of 7, you note that uh, the coefficients are not like terms that we can combine. So what we can do now, or the best we can actually do, then would be to factor the i out of both of those terms. And so we'll then have 12 minus the square root of 7 multiplied by i. So now the answer is an a plus bi form. And just to point out, that difference there would be our a value. And 12 minus the square root of 7 would be our b value.